Hi everyone, my name is Wing Liang, the Aragon watch designer, and welcome to our Aragon watch review. We are going to talk about one of the most highly anticipated um, watch that I posted a photo not too long ago. Oh yeah, by the way, it's, I can't believe how fast time is, has gone by. It's actually, I posted a photo back in February is the brand new Dive Master 42 millimeter meteorite, okay? And we're gonna have two movement choices and two platings, I mean, not two platings, one, one is stainless steel, one, the other one is gunmetal. Uh, and we also have two, one is a ceramic bezel and the other one is the meteorite bezel. And I think it's gonna be very interesting. And, um, and this has been one of our very successful collection. Um, I think it's a size. Uh, many people have have always expected we make 50 millimeter or large watch cases, and we're expanding to a um, you know to a 40, 42 millimeter case category. We're not cutting out the large, but we're just expanding one more size category. Um, and then this is a very good looking collection. I, I really have to tell you this. So I'm gonna uh, talk about the specs and then we're gonna come in and so everybody can look closely at the collection. So 42 millimeter, sapphire crystal, meteorite, dial, and ceramic bezel will be the SII NX35, okay? Which is on this side. We're gonna have a close up. White loom, glow screen, okay? 200 meters water resistance, solid stainless steel bracelet and clasp. And then on this side, we're gonna have the uh, meteorite bezel, meteorite dial, sapphire with AR. They're all with anti-reflective coating, by the way. Um, 42 millimeter, 200 meters water resistance, and most importantly, is our first ever Swiss automatic movement with the Ronda R150, okay? So let's come in and let's talk about it. And we are gonna do, also show you something very interesting. Uh, is the purple meteorite, okay? So, here we go. So the first one right here, so the difference is brushed stainless steel and gunmetal, okay? There's, they're both identical, but they're separated between the stainless steel and the gunmetal, okay? So I'm gonna go back to this one. So black ceramic, white loom glows green, and this is purple meteorite. This is heat treated, purple meteorite. So now, let me say this. Uh, because before we show uh, the heat treated, but this one is new, okay? It's in heat treated purple. So you're gonna have uh, a gradient of different colors, okay? You're gonna see purple, you're gonna see blue, but the majority of the color is purple. Okay, so you're gonna have a dark purple, you're gonna have a light purple, you're gonna have light blue and darker blue, okay? It really depends what angle you're looking at it. So we can't control, you know, the exact color because these are all natural material. These are all done by heat treated process. All right, over here, okay, what we call is a, more like a copper, okay? But it's more like a rose. So it's between the rose tone and the copper. So if you receive, let's say if you order this and then your dial had, you know, your dial have more of a lighter tone. So it's, which is absolutely okay, okay? So again, we can't control because there's so much color variations on the dial, okay? So you can see that. And now over here, 
we call this gold, okay? Same thing, you can see this striation, and then there's light and there's dark, there's dark gold, okay? These are all being done by plating, okay? I'm just talking about the gold and the rose, okay? He treated. Now go back to this. This is all natural, okay? It's in this silverish color, all natural meteorite dial. Very good. So the thickness of this watch is between 14 and 15. So his moles is 14.75 millimeter in thickness. Okay, I'm gonna show it to you from the profile. Screw it on crown. And then the bracelet is done in four millimeter. Exhibition case back. Rotor is decorated in that blue Aragon rotor. Okay, solid decline clasp. Very, very good looking. All right, so we made this execution in Seiko Automatic Movement NX35 and Ceramic Basil to be more affordable, all right? So it's still very high quality, super high quality. And then I'm gonna put on the gunmetal. All right, so I'm gonna put on this rose, copper. Really good looking, amazing. All right, and then I don't know who's doing this heat treated purple, okay? So just wanna put it on and show everyone. Very good looking. So very low profile. You can see it has that Dive Master 42 quality. The hands screw down crown to 200 meters water resistance. And then the difference between this row and this row is brushed stainless steel and brushed gunmetal, okay? Very nice. All right, over here, this is the good stuff. And I like them both equally, I have to say that. Now, so what we're gonna do is the bezel is meteorite. The dial is also meteorite. And this is heat treated purple, okay? Sapphire crystal with AR, anti-reflective coating. Swiss made Ronda R150, first time for Aragon brand to use the Ronda 150. Uh, brushed stainless steel and the gunmetal on this upper row. So, but we're gonna go across. And then the next one here is the copper bezel, meteorite bezel, copper meteorite bezel with the copper meteorite dial. All right, so again, I'm gonna emphasize this. So it depends because we can't control, these are all natural materials. We cannot control the texture, the striation, and you could get one with a little bit copper or a little bit lighter, okay? So now this is the gold, same thing, okay? Bezel, emeterite gold, and the dial as well. And I'll show you the, um, the, the Ronda R150 at the end of the, um, the video. So this is all natural, all natural on the bezel and on the dial. And then let me see if I can show it to you. Okay, not this one. I removed the plastic film. See this? This is the Ronda three screws, Ronda R150. Okay, and I'm gonna wear the gunmetal version. Okay, and then I'm gonna wear the heat treated purple. So that's what we're known for. And this is the reason why I wanna launch the heat treated purple first. And then I'm gonna show you the gold, which they're all beautiful, by the way. I just have to say this, uh, it's no bias and I understand you're watching it through the video and make a decision on which color you're gonna purchase, but they're absolutely stunning. If you can go for the more expensive one, I mean, if your budget is much bigger, definitely go for this. Meteorite bezel, meteorite dial with the Swiss automatic R150. But if you have a budget, okay, and you wanna, you know, um, I made a, well, by the way, I should say it like that. I made meteorite dial much more affordable, okay? Every, you know, bef years before, you, you have to spend so much money. But Aragon, everybody knows that we are 
making watches, high quality watches, and affordable price. And that's what we are. And this is the a proven fact, high quality with the Seiko NX35, you know, scratch resistant with the Sapphire Crystal and the bezel. This is an amazing collection, by the way. So I hope I cover all, um, you know, everything uh, about this collection, the Dive Master Meteorite, okay? Automatic. Uh, and I wanna quickly, uh, wanna talk about the Dive Master 3 very quickly, and I'm gonna move this on the side, okay? because um, we are running a sale and we are gonna extend it for another week because we wanna pair it with the Dive Master 42 Meteorite. I don't want you to miss the opportunity. So, okay, so now we're running a sale on this. It was the Memorial Weekend Sale. This is the Dive Master 3 NH37, okay? With the crown at the nine o'clock position. Two sizes, 50 millimeter, and 45. So what's interesting about this collection is, number one, it has that retro curved crystal, okay? The crown at the nine o'clock position, and the 24 hour indicator is located at the five o'clock. That what makes this watch very interesting, okay? And we're running a sale, we are extending it for one more week, because by the way, these are nearly sold out, the green, the blue, and uh, we have a little bit more with the 45, probably like 10 and 10 or 12 pieces more than the 50 millimeter. The 50 millimeter is selling much faster, okay? We're doing really good uh, with the silver. We still have, uh, in, you know, enough quantity uh, that everybody can get one. And I'm gonna put it on. I'm gonna put on the 45. By the way, it doesn't matter the crown is at three o'clock or nine o'clock position. You know, I know some of the guys are just gonna say, make a comment and say, Oh, the crown is at nine o'clock position for a lefty. No, it is not. It's because is if the crown is at the nine o'clock position, imagine you put it on your wrist on your right on your left hand. So the crown doesn't dig into the back of your wrist or your hand. Okay? So it's something unique. You know, if you're a watch collector out there, you might have a lot of dive watches. And you look at this and be like, oh, that's cool. I don't have something like that with a crown at the nine o'clock position, or you do, but I don't have an NH37 with the Dive Master, you know, with the 24 hour indicator at the five o'clock position. Because under the normal circumstance, when you have the crown at the three o'clock, the 24 hour indicator will locate at the 11 o'clock position. So I twisted the movement and make this into a much more unique timepiece. And by the way, Everything being so expensive nowadays, and the, the sales price that we put on this watch is absolutely ridiculous. It's like half the price of what, what you go, or, or it's like, it's pretty much like less than, a, less than a meal at McDonald's. That's how I can describe it. I mean, nowadays I have, I have three kids and I take my kids once in a while to McDonald's and after we order like drinks for everyone and everybody, you know, get this and get that. And I look at the bill, it's like, is this, this is like fine dining price at McDonald's. So the point I'm trying to say is the sales price, the memorial sales price of the Dive Master 3 NX37 is ridiculous. I, that's all I have to say. Okay, 200 meters water resistance, uh, solid deploying, I'm sorry. So solid stainless steel, first end link, bracelet, and the clasp is folded stainless steel. And then if you want, you can upgrade this to a uh, solid deploying clasp. You, all you have to do is just go to add-on and you save a lot of money, okay? 120 clicks, rotating bezel. And um, this is it. This is a great collection. And I'm glad I did two collections uh, together. So everybody has a great opportunity to buy and pick up multiple watches. And we made it so affordable and I hope you enjoy them all. Okay, so thanks guys, and I will see you next time.